Here's another bit of help with research methods in A-level psychology. Now, today we're going to look at the difference between naturalistic observations, controlled observations, overt observations, and covert observations. Firstly, naturalistic observations. These happen in real world environments like a classroom or park where behavior is studied as it naturally occurs. This increases ecological validity, but reduces control over variables. Then we've got controlled observations. These take place in a structured environment like a lab. Researchers manipulate certain variables while observing behavior, allowing for replication and control, but reducing realism. Next, there's over observations, and these are when participants know they are being observed. Researchers might take notes while sitting in a public space, and because people are aware, their behavior may change. This is called demand characteristics. And then finally, we've got covert observations, and these are done secretly, meaning participants are unaware they're being studied. This reduces demand characteristics and gives more natural 